guys welcome back to our channel i'm madison and this is christian and today we're going to be watching the shang chi trailer and we've definitely said before that anytime a trailer comes out we get really hyped about it and we watch it immediately but this time we were patient and we wanted to watch it with you so in honor of our new marvel hero that we're getting we're wearing our marvel avengers t-shirts and I honestly can't wait for this uh, movie, so. Yeah, we're definitely hyped for this one in particular. Um, you can tell Marvel Studios really went in on the Chinese influence for this one, oh, trying yeah. to pander to both markets a little bit. So it's going to be interesting how they balance that with the Western audience wants, what the international audience wants. Um, but I think they got a perfect cast for Shang-Chi and Simu Liu. I know he's up to the challenge. Oh, yeah. If I did have one criticism oh, for this God. movie's cast, it would have to be Aquafina. I'm sorry, Aquafina stands. Something about her voice is just like negative ASMR to me. It's like nails on a chalkboard or something. It's like, it's like grinding. <laughs> I'm, I, look, I'm gonna say I'm a little bit biased towards her because I loved Raya in The Last Dragon and she was a dragon. She was pretty funny. So I like her, so I'm excited. Too. But that aside, you know, I'm sure we're gonna love this movie. It already seems like it has dope ass fight scenes. They didn't really show too much of his powers in the first trailer. It That's was just kind of him kicking ass and stuff. Um, so I, I want to see his uh, powers a little bit more in this in this one. I know he kind of has like a Naruto clone jutsu ability where he can make duplicates of himself. That'd so cool. I want to see if that's in this trailer. If, if a little bit of his powers in the trailer, I'll be a happy camper. All right, guys. Thanks for joining us today. I think we're ready to get into the trailer. So let's do it. Let's do it. Dang. If you want them to be yours one day, oh, you have to show me you are strong enough to carry them. Oh my god, I just I got I want to see how the rings can stack up like against the, the stones, you know, like oh, in power level. That's true. your family. You are your mother. And whether you like it or not, you are also your father. Dang, the cinematography oh looks so God. cool. Oh my God, I have chills. I was right. He is just a criminal. Oh. Who murders people. Oh, so he doesn't like his dad. Oh my god, is she an airbender? That is so cool! I I could change my name. Start a new life. Ah, oh, there's your girl, Aquafina. Never escape his shadow. Yo, this is gonna look so awesome! You can't run from your past. Oh, that was dope. That was <laughs> so cool! What is that? Is that a dragon? Is that Fing Fang Foom? Oh. Oh shit. Hey. Hey. You got this. Thank you. What the hell was that? Dude. That looked like abomination kinda. You wanna run from, it back? Uh, from the Hulk movie? So we didn't get the Naruto Jutsu kind of power, but we did get to see a lot of the action with the rings. Like, dude, yeah, that was it looks crazy. like most of the focus is on the rings themselves. He didn't do the Naruto clone Jutsu thing. Yeah, but I feel like it might be like uh, they're just saving that for the movie, or may maybe he's got to learn those things throughout the movie. True. And then like moving forward, he'll be able to do all his powers and stuff. Yeah, we saw some girl like you know doing some martial arts but it looked like she was literally bringing the wind because the leaves were following in the same motion yeah. her arms were so i'm wondering if we're gonna see some more like people with some crazy abilities i've seen uh, another scene with that lady in it and it seems like a flashback scene oh, okay. so i'm assuming there's gonna be a lot of explanation as to where the ten rings originate from and stuff like that why his dad has i them. need to know if that giant dragon was fing fing foom and it looks like abominations in this too oh, for from real. the incredible hulk movie tim roth might be coming back to play him i don't know interesting 
There was a lot of stuff in that trailer I wasn't expecting. Concerning what looked like Fing Fang Foom, I just read that even Simu Liu himself kind of denied that Fing Fang Foom was in this movie at all. Um, then the dragon is called the Great Protector, which is kind of making me think like he is Fing Fang Foom in spirit, but just not in name. Because they don't want to use an obviously stereotypical Chinese name that was created long ago for their new MCU projects moving forward. Right. They did the same thing with the Fu Manchu character. They didn't want to use that, so they oh, changed it. yeah. True. Um, so it'll be interesting to see if it is Fing Fing Foom or if it's just some other space dragon or something. Uh, but I did not expect that to be in this movie, let alone in the trailer. Yeah, and that that wasn't in the last one. Like uh -uh. we did not get any kind of like anything like that. It was all just like fight scenes and running around cities and stuff. So I'm I'm really excited. I liked seeing um, all the rings like fly back on their arms, like. I guess I don't understand like what the powers are. Do they each each ring has an individual power, or do do they all work together? See, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how the MCU is going to approach it. That's true. Yeah, because I know they're going to make it different. But yeah, it seems like the entire movie is going to be centered around, I guess, Shang Chi learning how to use these rings or getting these rings. Getting them. It looks like getting them away from his father because we're seeing a lot of like video of him when he was a yeah. kid. Seeing his dad, I'm guessing he's not guessing he's not a good guy. Because... Father versus son, getting some invincible vibes. <laughs> oh, let's do it. <laughs> no, um, but yeah, I think it's gonna be something along those lines. Him getting yeah. the rings, learning how to use them. But this movie looks very exciting. Lots of set pieces, lots of fight scenes, lots of one v ones, and a lot of returning story villains. To tell, too. A lot of story to tell. New uh, powers, new oh, those. Yeah rings can anyone use them or like what's the deal with them can they stand up to like the power of the stones and stuff yeah like we haven't really had anything to compare them to so yeah. i would really be interested to seeing like you know how powerful these rings are oh i'm excited for this movie and just in general i think we're just excited for marvel moving forward oh of course all the projects have been great thus far Hyped for all the movies coming out this year. Still waiting on that Black Widow. It's Marvel's year this year. It really it is. is. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all so much for joining us. We're so hyped for this movie. If you want to see us react to more trailers and TV shows, you know what to do. Like and subscribe down at the bottom. Leave a comment, anything we missed from the trailer or any Easter eggs that you guys saw that we didn't get to see. You guys are always good at catching those. Of course. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace Bye, guys. Out.